Did somebody say Banjo Kazooie? I think it was me. Oh. I said it. Why? Because I thought it would be fun. It is quite fun. Oh, hello, mate. So that's what those guys do. <laughs> um, but yeah, so welcome back to more Rage and Joe play Banjo Kazooie. In the last part, we came to Rusty Bucket Bay. In this part, we're continuing in Rusty Bucket Bay. It's kind of how this game works. <laughs> you do something and then. <laughs> And then you're done with doing it for a while. Oh, oh time puzzle! Man. Go, Rachel, go! 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 What's gonna happen? Well, if you believe, and jump right now! Oh! Get up, you bastards! <laughs> oh! <laughs> no! <laughs> right? Maybe you were like just under the boundary of the cage. Right. So we didn't. Oh. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> well, she did it, everybody. But now we've got to go back to find out what we missed. Exactly. Because that's the easiest Let's way. Be thorough. To... Exactly. Be methodical, and not end up with five notes missing and nothing with it. <laughs> exactly. That's that's the main difficulty with playing Banjo Kazooie. You have to like do it by areas, otherwise you're never gonna know where you're missing G's and or notes and or. Gingers. Super narrow platform time, go! That was easy! <laughs> Super narrow? <laughs> narrow within the last one. Yes. Twice as narrow, you might say. These ones seem taller and thinner than the ones that were in Clank's Cabin. These are the Luigi of the slugs. <laughs> Luigi of Rusty Buck Bay to the Mario of Planker's Cow. I'm always remembering this as a nice little health sink. <laughs> uh, we've already come across at least 12 honeycombs uh, with bees on them now. In fact, we've even defeated one. Yes. What's wrong with you? <laughs> Clearly he's not really in contact with the other ones. He's just like, oh, I bet I'm the first one to have done this. <laughs> This is a great idea, yes. well done me. <laughs> I'm gonna pat myself on the back <laughs> once I develop arms. <laughs> ah, you must have learned. Oh, I found him again! Ah, oh, you must have learned. <laughs> Solve all your problems by pooping eggs at them. That's the lessons Banjo Kazooie teaches you. Someone threatening to blow you up? Throw eggs at them! From your buttocks. It might just be easier to build them better with their asses. Ooh, that was close. <laughs> oh. Hey. That wasn't a jiggy. Mm -hmm. However, if I recall correctly, in the middle... What's one of these called? <laughs> container? I guess, yeah, there's a container. Shipping container? In the middle shipping container, I think there's an enormous box filled with smaller boxes. Smaller boxes! <laughs> boxes and boxes and boxes! So I should have saved my gold, really. Eh, I think you'll probably still be alright. You'll at least be able to get through the first few rounds with the giant box. And then by the time they're small ones, you can just go back to eggs or whatever. Oh, maybe it's not in this one. Yeah, somewhere later. But yeah, there's probably on the ship. Hey, Jinjo! Give me a hug. Hi. Hi to you too. Hi. Man, these guys are talkative. Hi. Jeez. They're very talkative, but they don't listen very well. It must have been fun just to do all the weird little noises. For <laughs> Um, anything else in this container? Hmm? Anything else in this container? Not that I know of. Maze and a Jinjo. <laughs> Maze and a Jinjo. A 3D version of a Jinjo, no less. Mm. Oh, oh, tits. <laughs> tits indeed, Rachel. Tits indeed. Um, yeah, no, I think that's all that that is. And then there's a tone thing on the other side of this one. Eek. Can you get up there? I think you get to it from the ship. Take a look. It's a crane again. Yes. Okay. For the ship then. 
to the ship. To the ship, 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 to the 
It's really weird that the only way to get into any of these rooms is to like <laughs> smash through windows and go down pipes. Anything else? Nope. Any secret Easter eggs? I think there might be actually if you look on the walls. There uh, might be pictures of, <laughs> that the sailors have put up. I think it's on the top bunk. Top bunk. Um. Hmm. Ow! Get off my bed! Oh, there's stuff going. Oh, well, mm -hmm. good thing we checked up here. There's stuff, but nothing Easter egg looking yet. Oh, <laughs> well, that's definitely an Easter egg. There's Conker from Conker's Bad Birdie, for those who don't know. And other games, but. Generally, people know him best for Conquered Bad Fur Day. Um, but yeah, if you want to go to the window we saw earlier, it's on the other side of the ship. So yeah, over to your right. And all the way near the front. You might be able to back up there. So close. Oi! Don't you extend at me, boy! I can smell you up there with my non existent nose. And then down. Should be the window you're looking for. Plunge! Plunge indeed. Back in the game. We got it! Right. Ooh, there's an X on that map. What are they looking for, do you suppose? Treasures! Also, where are they, do you suppose? Ah, that is the first question. In Banjo Land! I wonder if that map, like, the shape of it is an Easter egg or something. Mm. Yeah. I'd love it if one of them was like DK Isle or something. I don't know. In any case, <coughs> so this is our control room. Let's destroy the buttons! Smash them all! <laughs> Sink this bastard. Yay! And all the jiggies it contains. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> bad idea, bad idea. No! Oh, you bastard! They are really mean. I couldn't get they any are. further away from him than I was. No, indeed. Um, right, well, let's get back onto the ship, but I'll end this episode for now. <laughs> we'll meet you up there. See you guys then for more ship-related madness. Cabin fever, you might say. <laughs> but probably wouldn't. Goodbye. <laughs>